Okay, hey guys. Uh, so first of all, I apologize for the angle. My tripod's very awkward. It shouldn't move once it gets itself settled. Um, but I figured I'd just do a binder tour here today. I kind of flipped through the binders I have. I have five binders. So this one's a miscellaneous binder. I have another miscellaneous binder, my infinite binder, my NCT and Stray Kids binder, and then my Astro and Day 6. So I'm just going to flip through them here. Later on, I'll do kind of like, uh, you know, like working on my binders with the fillers, those types of things. Uh, I filmed a little bit of one of the Pentagon sections here, which you'll see, which is the uh, Black Hall is done. Um, so, yeah, here goes a tour. Okay, like I mentioned, this one is my miscellaneous binder, so it has a lot of different groups. Um, so first, uh, more my foot, sorry. <laughs> first we have AT, so I collect some on Hongjun. Um, not doing the best with their collection because AT's is kind of difficult. Um, but I do have episode one on the way for Sungwa. And these, I've said this previously, I don't know if that video is going to get uploaded. I don't know how I feel about these pages yet. Um, I like that they're all black because on my normal pages I use like these little like fillers. Not fillers, penny sleeves. Um, so... I'm testing out these with some of the sections. I like that it's all black. I kind of like that it's back, like there's a back to it, but I also feel like I have to use the back and I don't know how I feel about the back necessarily. <laughs> um, so it may change in the future. I don't know, I change things pretty frequently. Uh, so yeah, Sungwa, not doing the best. I don't even know why I decided to collect as my music taste cards because they're impossible, but here we are. And then Hongjun. Uh, this trade was the greatest trade of my life, honestly. I got this Hongjun card for a tail empathy card that I had pulled, and I lost my mind when I got it, honestly. Um, so yeah, there's my AT section. Those are really of no order to them, I just shoved them in there, honestly. Um, and then I have my VAV section, which I collect St. Vaughn and Jacob. Uh, when it comes to them, these are going to be for the Spotlight Clear cards, which I'm obviously missing. Uh, I had... Who did I have? I think I had Barons. No, I had Aces, which I cross traded for something stupidly because it was before the album was out of print. And then I had Barons Photo Card, which I also cross traded before the album was out of print, and now I'm upset. <laughs> but uh, we have Vaughn and this, the Light Stick Card, which isn't going to stay there. I got to rearrange this page. Um, and then Jacob, the only thing I'm missing once again is Spotlight. And then we have Oneus to collect Kwon I don't know why that's there. Uh, and for the posters, that's why that's there, because I had the posters in it. I have both of Jacob and Vaughn's Poison posters. They're on my walls, though. Um, and then I have Oneus, which I'm missing one of Hwanwoon's postcards. Um, but other than that, I have everything, I think, other than that postcard. And I have his My Music Taste card from the new album. Uh, so it's Oneus. So I made this before I decided who I was collecting for the boys. Now, obviously, I collect Hyunjae. He's my bias. Um, but I also collect Eric and Sanyeon. Uh, so these are just kind of non-album cards. The only non-album cards for Sanyeon I'm collecting is his My Music Taste cards. Everything else, al non-album-wise, is just going to be Hyunjae and Eric. So I'm doing better with Eric than I am with Hyunjae. So that's Hyunjae's section. Uh, those are from the first album. Um, and then this is Eric's non-album section. This card is my prized possession when it comes to the boys. Hold on, let me turn my music down. One second. Okay, so yes, this is my prized possession when it comes to the boys' cards because he's so flippin' cute. And this broadcast card was hard to find and it was expensive. I don't want to talk about it, but it was cute. So this is my Eric non-album cards. Um, this is kind of where it comes into, originally I didn't have, like, a crossed. So this was on like a separate page. I don't know how I feel about this yet. Still working on it. But as you can tell, I'm missing one Hyunjae card. And then Sangyun is not doing the best. <laughs> um, I prioritize Hyunjae and Eric first. And then go back for Sangyun. So this one is also not doing the best. This is a corner from the music video of the like pinball machine. And then of course this is from the album. So these fillers I made. I have some that someone made for me for some of the groups. I'm probably going to replace this one with theirs because they're better than mine. Um, but I have to go through and print those out and decide kind of which fillers I'm using. Uh, so that's kind of where we are with the boys. As you can tell, I'm missing a lot of those. Hyunjae's done working on the others. With the boys, originally what my goal was was to 
finish the cards for each album that I have and then buy one. So, like, I had Dreamlike, so I was like, I'm going to finish the Dreamlike cards, I'm going to finish Bloom Bloom because that's what I had. And then I bought Reveal and it's kind of all over the place, so I only have all three Dreamlike versions, all three Reveal, one of their first album, and then Bloom 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 version. Uh, so, I mean, with the Bloom 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 version, I have all of the postcards, um, so kind of, and I just need Sangyeon's to be done with that version, so then I'll buy the other version and finish it. This is actually, I hate the way the yellow came out, but this is cut from Kevin's teaser photo, I think. It's just like the corner. I tried to pull stuff from it, um, but this is Dreamlike. Uh, I have, I think I have all four of these cards on the way from a group order. Not sure. I'm pretty sure they're all on the way, but <laughs> I cannot remember. This is the very first The Boys card I ever pulled, and it was before I really knew all the members. I was like, I'm going to buy this album. And I, at this point, Kevin was my bias. <laughs> and so I pulled Hyunjae, and I was like, oh, this is such a cute card. And I had to post it for trade. And then I was like, but I low-key don't want to post this because it's cute. And so I was like, I'll just keep it because it's cute. And then it's because he's my bias. So <laughs> there's that. Um, and then I have their booklets from Dreamlike. With their postcards, I'm missing one of Eric's, which I have on the way now. And then I'm missing one of Sanghyun's as well. And then... Reveal is a mess. I'm struggling with Reveal, honestly. Postcard-wise, I'm get, I'm decent. I'm missing one Hyunjae, uh, one Eric, and then all of Sangyun's. And then these, I have all of Hyunjae's, and I'm only missing one of Eric's. And then I have two of Eric's, like, scratch cards. But the section back here, I haven't finished, like, organizing to be cute. And these are just freebies. And, like, the stickers. Then we have Pentagon. This is a very new section, so I am the fillers obviously are sitting over here from earlier. Um, right now I'm only collecting Hui and Kino. May add Jinho, I don't know. <laughs> I pulled one of his cards and clearly put it in here because I didn't want to get rid of it. But I don't technically want to collect him yet because I want to finish Kino and Hui. So, we're struggling. I got all of their albums today. Minus Demo 1, I did get that the other day. So all of the cards are up for trade that I pulled, essentially, except for some of these that are clearly in here. This is the only section that I've put the fillers in so far. Um, but yeah, so if you collect Pentagon, and you collect uh, Shinwan or Yanan or... Who else did I pull? I think I pulled a Yuto card. Go check out my trade account, because they'll be posted there for trades. And then this, I just have to figure out where I want to put it, because it does not fit in the sleeves. So working on that but then I have came out <laughs> I pulled both of these and it was a great moment um and then I had bought these stickers for Kino and Yolan when I thought he was gonna be my third that I might collect and then I pulled literally both of those so I've already tried Kino for Hui my extra Kino and then now I have two Yolan ones that I don't know if I'm gonna trade them for Jinho and then keep the second Yolan I don't know what I'm doing with those um then I have my Ruben section for one team I have completed all of his cards in po well, not all the postcards, but all of his cards, including the My Music Taste, um, and then I have the postcards from the new album. I do not have the bookmarks yet. I have Jaehyun and Jenwoo's bookmarks that I can't trade, so not super high priority to finish the bookmarks, but it would be nice. So if you guys have it and you collect them, message me. They're also posted on my trade account. I am missing the second postcard set from the first album. I never realized I was missing it until recently. <laughs> I forgot, honestly. Um, but yeah, so those are there. And then Victon, I haven't put like a cover like I did for all the other groups so far. Um, Pentagon, I haven't done either. Um, so yeah, Victon, once again, someone made me inserts for Victon as well, and I haven't gone in and updated them. Just kind of stuck with the ones I have so far. Uh, as you can see, I'm collecting three members and struggling, but it's fine. <laughs> we'll get there eventually. Um, but yeah, so there's Victon. I have two of the three booklets, and I have an extra one of these, so if you collect and you want uh, Chan and Sejun, message me, because we'll trade, because that's I only need one more. But yeah, so that's my first miscellaneous binder. I'm going to do Infinite real quick, and then I will do NCT and Stray Kids next after Infinite. So I know Infinite, not a lot of people collect them, because they're an older group. They're my alt group, so for them, I am doing 
OT7 for Korean albums, and then Japanese albums, just Dongwoo. So, and then like, this is like season's greetings and fanship stuff. If you look at it just Dongwoo wise, I'm doing great. If you look at it as OT7, I'm struggling. <laughs> These are falling out. I need new pages for these. They're just in there for now until I get updated pages. Paradise is done. New challenge. Struggling. <laughs> What's new? Ah, <laughs> new challenge. Anyway. Destiny. Also struggling. Fun fact, this is the first photo card I ever pulled, ever, because Destiny was the first album I ever got. And I pulled Myungsu, and he was on my wall for the longest time, so there's tape on the back of that. Luckily, I'm not trying to trade him because I'm keeping him. Uh, season 2, slowly getting there. The back, a mess. What's new? The real date cards, the struggle with these is finding them not ripped. So this one I had bought off of eBay strictly because it wasn't ripped, but the person who sent it folded it and then sent it to me. So it's like on the edge of ripping, but it's put down, so hopefully it does not rip. And then we have reality. This is my favorite set. So cute. This irks me. These photo cards irk me. You can barely see them, but I'm only missing one, but I'm annoyed. Um, and then I have this other top seed card on the way. This is the first thing I ever did fillers for, and I don't know how I feel about it still. May update it. Don't know. We're just keeping it for now. And then Infinite H. These cards also kind of annoy me because they're so similar. So they're not super high priority, but I'm doing alright with them. Just have four left. This I made out of one of my extra Infinite H albums, and I'm obsessed. This man has my heart. This is... Whew, I love him so much. But he's my alt bias, so like, that makes sense. Uh, only missing his other fly again card, which I have a whole extra set of this Hoya. Uh, so I might post them like, separate for trades for infinite cards I'm missing, and then if I have to, I might offer all three of these to that last card. <laughs> Because I can't really trade it for much else. Uh, Infinite F, which I just recently got the album, so I don't have that many cards. Uh, two Heart, I just need Keys solo cards and the two unit cards. Dongu solo album. This is my favorite set of photo cards. I mean, I am biased because he's my bias. But I struggled to find this photo card and this photo card for the longest time. So I had these three easy. I think I pulled these two and I bought this one. And then my friend for Christmas found both of these, which this is my all-time favorite, like, Dongwoo card. She found both of these and got them for me for Christmas, and I almost cried. Sungi's solo albums, which I need to work on. Woo Young. Once again, also need to work on. Then I have Hoya's solo stuff, which, as you can tell, also still struggling. Then some Japanese postcards, which I was lucky enough to find these as a set instead of separate. So that's awesome. And then I have Dongwoo's like Pepsi cards, which I'm obsessed with because they're cute. And then his Dilemma card. Dilemma card. And then the uh, 2012 concert uh, cards. I had originally gotten this in like a box of infinite stuff that I had gotten. And then I found someone selling this as a set for $20, which people try to sell them separate for $20. So I snatched them as quick as I could. Um, and this is like official cards that aren't, don't really have a place. So like Sung Yeol, I have posted for trade, but I know I'm probably never going to trade them, so I'm just going to keep them. And this is, I think, a pre-order card that I got, and then the star cards. And then this starts just, like, freebies and things I got. Uh, so I have a lot of these from that giant box of random infinite stuff that I got at one point <laughs> from someone on Facebook. So it's a lot of, like, fan site stuff. A lot of Hoya, because she's a Hoya fan site. Um... And then these are just freebies that I've gotten in trades and things. And these are pictures I had hanging on my wall at one point. Like, biases together. Um, and then, like, postcards and stickers. And then these are two DVDs from a couple concerts. They're fan cams, so that's really cool to have. But yeah, so that's my infinite section. Once again, if you compare it with Dongwoo, I'm almost, like, infinite, like, Korean-wise, I'm almost done. Japanese still have a way to go, and then, like, OT7 I have a way to go. But there's that. Alright, next is my Stray Kids in NCT binder. These two, I'm going to sit down, so my voice may change. <laughs> These two, um, this binder is a little more organized than the others have been, I think. 
I think it's still, <laughs> honestly, who knows, I've worked on kind of my miscellaneous binder a lot as well. Um, so we have NCT, which I collect all of Johnny's stuff in select, like, non-album cards. All of Mark's, like, album cards. All of Taeyong's album cards, which I recently added, so some of these don't have spots for Taeyong because I haven't I hadn't decided yet. And then Renjun's dream stuff. And then Ten, Kun, and Yang Yang. Is that everyone? I think so. So, yes. This I bought for someone for Christmas, and she already had it, so I kept it because it's from the concert I saw them in. Uh, Johnny and Renjun's non-album stuff that I have, or, like, Japanese stuff. And then this is from the magazine. Oh. I have these two on the way, so fire truck is getting there. Limitless stuff. I also have Johnny's sticker on the way. These are just, like, my top three in the group one. Because I had everyone in there, but it's taking up too much room. Uh, Cherry Bomb. This is the card that started me deciding to collect Taeyong. Because I pulled this and I didn't want to get rid of it. So I was like, I'll only collect him for certain stuff. Now I'm going to add him and collect him for everything. Uh, empathy. I'm missing a bunch of cards. Which I'll have to add Taeyong here. Regular Irregular. We'll have to add him down here. I'm going to update these as well. Because I made these and the girls made me some more that are better. So I'm going to use hers instead of mine. Uh, regulate also have to add tail superhuman is another one that kind of led to me wanting to collect him because i had his cards already this i made out of an extra nasone album like i did with the dong Wu one because uh, i was bored one day quarantine you know and then we have uh, nasone which this card's on the way so that'll be done soon uh marks i have doyoung and johnny i think i'm gonna trade or post for trade for that and then I need to get Taeyong's tea stuff and the other circle card, which I have a Doyoung circle card up for trade for that. So if you're a Doyoung stan, come come message me because <laughs> I have some Doyoung stuff. Uh, but then for Dream, obviously Mark and Renjun. I need to redo this section to get the last photo card, um, but I have his Wee Boom card, which is so cute. And the Kino stuff. And then the new album, which I haven't done fillers for, and I pulled this, so I'm trading for the rest. I think I have the circle card that goes here on the way. So, yep. And these, of course, I haven't done really anything with, but put them in there. Wavy! Ten is a struggle! <laughs> and this card is so freaking cute, and I can't find it anywhere for a decent price, and I'm annoyed. But yes, originally I wasn't collecting Yang Yang, but, and I pulled this circle card and tried to trade for the longest time. And then he ruined my life and became a bias wrecker, and so here we are. This is the only wavy section I have complete. <laughs> She's so cute. Um, of course, missing 10, as freaking always. And then we have the vacation, summer, summer, yep, Keiko English. Uh, and then Super M, which originally I was only going to collect these three, that's why they have fillers. But as you can tell, that didn't stay that way. I don't think I'm going to do their Korean versions of the cards just because I'm content with that and the tour cards. So we'll just stick it with that for now. And a little freebies. And then Stray Kids, which I collect Chan, Minho, and Woojin. Um, so we have the fanship cards, the tour cards, some postcards, mixtape, which this is supposed to be on the way, but it's coming from India and they're in like shutdown right now because Corona, so it'll take a while. Um, I will say my I am who section, not I am who, I do that every time. I am you section sucks. Um, this is not on the way, never mind. This card I originally pulled and I wasn't collecting him, so I traded it. And now I regret it. Biggest regret. Um, but yeah. I think I have a couple of these on the way. I'm not really sure. I have a few Minho cards on the way. Like I said, this section rough. I'm probably gonna have to buy extra copies of the album and just hope I pull cards. Because <laughs> people are selling things for too much. And then Miro. Yellow Wood. Which these fillers as well are gonna be replaced. And then someone did like a fan event thing for these unofficial cards for Wujin. Uh, so I have them in there for now for Levanter. Going further, I haven't decided if I'm going to just collect Chan and Minho or if I'm going to add Jisung. 
for the rest of the albums. I do not know. These are from a coffee event, cup sleeve event in New York. And then this J card. I need to post for trade. Every time I flip through this binder, I'm like, I need to take this out. And I never do. So I'm going to take it out real quick. Anyway, so freebies. And then like, these are from the cup sleeve event. This is from the first year I saw them in concert. And then my number from build. And then these freebies are from the first year as well in concert. So he, oh gosh, everything is running away. So yeah, there is my Straight Kids and NCT section, or binder. Next I will briefly flip through Astro and Day6 because that collection is a struggle. They're one of those groups that I've, or they're both groups I've been into for so long. So I don't really prioritize card collecting as much. Um, just because I liked them before I was huge into collecting. I don't know why my brain is the way it is. It's like with Vix, my albums aren't finished, but I've loved them for so long. I don't know how to explain it. But they're not super high priority. Also, at one point, I was really prioritizing day six, and then I was scammed out of, like, 11 cards. <laughs> so I lost interest for a while of collecting because I was upset. Um, so these are before I started printing things out. I'm doing decently for, like, the earlier albums. It's just when you get to Gravity and Entropy that I'm struggling. And then, of course, Demon's out now, so it's just getting worse. <laughs> so, yes. I collect J. And then Sunjin for things that there are two of. I will eventually probably collect Sunjin if I ever finish J. I have like a page of Sunjin stuff that I've pulled that I just don't want to get rid of. Uh, so that's probably what I'm going to continue doing until I decide to actually collect him. These pages as well I haven't gone in and actually fixed up. So Japanese cards or like miscellaneous cards. Um, for the Polaroids for Sunrise, I think I'm going to collect them all just because I love how cute they are. So, that's the goal for those. Astro, once again a struggle, <laughs> as you can tell. Their newer albums aren't too bad. I'm going to try, I think I'm going to prioritize those next, like when it comes to Astro and finishing from Rise Up forward, because with like, MJ only have three for All Light. I have his other bookmark on the way, so it's just two albums for Blue Flame, and then I'll go work backwards in between albums. I'll work back and try and find these earlier cards. So like Rise Up, I'm only missing one of Jin Jin's and I have his whole All Light set. And then, oh, I also have MJ's little letter on the way too. So it's just his other bookmark and these two cards. And then freebies and like postcards, which like this is just thrown in there because I haven't actually gone in and put it in. The same as these, which are a mess, but All Light is pretty up to date and pretty actually complete and then like the books so yeah there's my astro binder and now i know this is a very long video but i'm gonna flip through the last binder here which is going to be my last miscellaneous binder so this one's a little smaller um it is also groups um that are kind of the same as astro and day six i've just kind of loved them for so long and loved them before i was into collecting that they've never really been a priority. So eventually I will finish them, but it's not one of those that like, it's bugging me that it's not finished. Um, so yeah, so I have my Mingyu section, which as I mentioned, is not good. It's decent for the fact that I don't prioritize Mingyu. Like he's listed as high priority on my account just because he has my bias. And like, if I have a card that I'm like, I'll trade to anything and it's like a priority, like, if I get a trade for him, he's technically priority, but his collection is... I don't know if that makes any sense. It's fine. Right now I have all of these in here, but I will probably go and put some of them back in the album. And this Coops card, I just couldn't pass up. Someone was selling to me for very cheap. <laughs> I'm not going to collect Coops, but I'm going to keep that one. Unless I find a trade for Minkyu, then maybe. Um, like tour cards, Japanese cards, those types of things. This is from the concert in January. And then, of course... Love and Letter. These are from the concert. Uh, just random Coop stuff that once again <laughs> I will eventually get rid of. Or not. Because Coops is my love. And then all the tour cards. And then freebies and stickers. Books. And then I have XO which I collect Lei, uh, Schumann, and Tao. 
Leia's priority out of the three, but obviously I am struggling with his collection as well. And then Tau. I have more non-album Tau cards. Well, I have like his these two solo album cards that I got the other day. Is why they're not in sleeves yet. Uh, so I haven't even like spaced out Tau and Schumann just because I want to focus on Leia first. But if I happen to get cards, then I take them. Uh, and then we have Monster X, which really doesn't have that much. Not super impressive. And then we have Vix, which slowly getting there. They're one of those that, once again, it's like their albums. I've loved them for so long. And they were my alt group very briefly. It was a brief time where I was confused and I didn't think Infinite was my alt group. So Vix was. And then I was like, what am I doing? Infinite is always been my alt. And they're going to say my alt. Anyway. <laughs> um, so Leo and Ravi, Bias and Bias Wrecker. We'll get there eventually. It's not super high priority and I can easily, like if I really sat down and was like, I'm going to find these cards and buy them, I could. I just haven't. And then like freebies. And this is like my miscellaneous like card and postcard section. So I was collecting God's Heaven for a while. Um, by, by Wrecker, But I stopped collecting them. And so these three cards I'm just kind of like emotionally attached to. This is my first God's Heaven album ever. And it was right when they debuted. Obviously it's the debut album. The Bam Bam was my bias at the time. So I pulled him and I was like, I'm never going to get rid of this. Then I originally pulled a different member. And I traded with someone on Tumblr before I knew trading was a thing. This is back when the album came out. So I'm like emotionally attached to that too. And then just this Young J card is cute. <laughs> uh, so the Young J card is the only one that I would possibly like trade. Uh, but probably not because I'm me. And then this is more like mis miscellaneous cards. So I have my CM Blue cards. Um, Woo Jin, Hobie, Yesung, Boomy, and then my In Black and Shiny cards. So yes, these are just, you know, if you're an in black stand and you need this card, message me because I will trade that one. I love in black. I miss in black so much, but Lee June was my bias. So like, this is just kind of, it came with a pack of other things that I had bought and I was like, oh, I miss them. Same with Yezung. Um, he was my bias in Super Junior, but I do not collect. So if you desperately need that card and have something I need, message me. But yeah, there are my binders. Sorry it's so long. I will eventually upload kind of like working on them. If you have any collections, questions, put them in the comments below and I'll answer them. If you have any collection, not collection, if you have any questions as to where I found things or how I prioritize, which honestly how I prioritize makes no sense to me. So it probably will make no sense to anybody else either. <laughs> um, but yeah, so just message me if you have any questions or if you have any trades, uh, go check out my trade account on Instagram. It is Kpop Multi Trades. And I have all my trades posted there, except for that J card that I just pulled out because I kept forgetting to post it for the longest time. Looking for his other version. So message me if you have it. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. Sorry this is so long. If you made it till the end, you're the MVP and hopefully found this enjoyable. If not, tell me what I did wrong in the, the comments below as well and I will try to fix it. But thank you once again and bye.